Hey everybody, it's Erin. I just wanted to do a short video on how to use Automatic CEO. Automatic CEO was made specifically for Beachbody coaches to help them keep track of um, interested prospects, uh, Beachbody customers that you are given, um, your coaches. It's it's a system of organizing so that you can use. Um, it's not free. It's $25 a month, which is not cheap. And it can be a little complicated to use at first, so I wanted to make this video just with my specific tips on and how I use it. So the first thing you can do is watch the new member webinar, and it, it's long. It's like two hours or something. There's two different ones. And you can go through and it tells you how to import all of the customers that Beachbody gives you for being Emerald or achieving success club. And you can go to specific parts on the webinar to go to go through that. I think it's worth it to go through the video when you're first starting. Um, kind of gives you a feel for how to navigate the website. But I wanted to show you how I use Automatic CEO. So the first the main area I go to is the contacts. So you'll see here on your homepage, this is your homepage. On the top left, you have different categories and you can make your own category. I made this one coaches. I use that to what, what you can do is you can go into your contacts that are coaches and then you can click on one button to highlight all of them. and then send them an email, all the emails at the same time. So for example, say there's a team coach call or something you wanna tell the team all at once and you don't wanna to have to send everyone an individual message, this will do it for them. The reason why I use this versus uh, say a Gmail um, list is that it shows you when they click on it and when they open it and if they read it and you can see who's engaging and who's not. So that's one way I use it is to communicate with my coaches. All of my customers, once they're imported from Beachbody, so on Beachbody it says I have like 560 customers and on here there's 373. That's because when you send your list to automatic CEO, they automatically take out anybody that has a do not contact or a restricted email. So this is what you're left with. All your customers. So these are all people that have ordered something from me and most likely they're people who I don't talk to on Facebook. These are just people that are given to me from Beachbody for being Emerald or Success Club. And you can go in, you can go in and if you want to be really super organized with it, you can put information about each person as you talk to them. You can say, you know, sent this message today and add it and it'll add a, a date, keeping track of when you, what you did with your people and what happened and the last time you sent them an email and did they open it. It can get, you can get really in depth with it. I generally don't unless they start my the way I do it is I send them these emails when they become a customer of mine and then when they start responding I guide them to Facebook and talk to everyone on Facebook so once you have the, your customers in this list there are two main ways to communicate with your customers and potential customers that I use the first is a one-touch email. So you go to the My Resources tab and click on one-touch email. Automatic CEO, because they are just for Beachbody coaches, comes up with pre-made templates for you to send to your customers every time something new comes out. So for example, um, where are we right now? January Challenge Packs. So right now, if you click on January Challenge Packs, you can edit this to be however you want about it. But I don't I don't really use the ones that they made because they I find that they are 
too salesy for me. And not only that, I tried using them and I didn't get any responses ever. No clicks, nobody ever paid any attention to them. Maybe they'll work for you, but for me, I had to edit my own to get any kind of response. So these are a great starting place when you're making your own. I love how you can do the click here. And I'll show you how you can do that. So let me show you the one that I just made not that long ago. Okay, so I made a Shakeology sample email. So if someone contacts me and says, I want to sample Shakeology, or says, uh, I did a post on Facebook, leave your email below and I'll send you an email about Shakeology and getting a free sample. So I put, I made this, I put this picture in. So Google, whatever picture, whatever picture you have, you can add a picture in and you can do, put your pictures either in your media library, which is also under my resources. You can just make a folder that has pictures that you add to automatic CEO that you can then upload from here and press this little green button here and then click what you want to add. So you can actually add video, you can add PDF files, you can add whatever you want to your email. I usually use photos. So you click photo, and then you click source, and you find where you're, you uploaded your picture in the media library. You can change the dimensions to make it bigger or smaller. And Automatic CEO will let you know if your pictures are too big, or your picture to text ratio is off, because it, all of those things, believe it or not, will make it so that you end up in spam. And Automatic CEO sets it up so that you, they are on the lookout for you. If you have something that is way too spam and you'll end up in somebody's spam folder, they don't even let you create it. So that's really helpful. So I added that picture at the top. And then you can say hi, and all of here, these bookmarks here are something you can add into the email. And it's set up already through your coach ID. So say you wanted to send someone a link to buy the 21 day fix challenge pack. All you have to do is click add bookmark here and click 21 day fix challenge pack and it gets put into your email. Somewhere. So it'll look like that with the percent signs, but when you um, when you actually send the email, it'll have the, the link for the 21 day challenge pack for people to, to click on directly. So it won't say prospect first name, it'll say hi Sue or hi Joe, and then it'll be personalized for you. So I put all this in for me personally, what I wanted to say, and then I said, if you want to get Shakeology and just get a whole month supply versus just a free sample, click here. So in order to do a click here something, you just type click here, highlight it, and then click this button here. It says insert edit link. And then you can add your link that sends you directly to where you can buy Shakeology from your website. So if you're not sure where those links are, a great website to find them is www.coachingcodes.com. That's www.coachingcodes.com and it has every link possible that we offer that you can just find really quick to throw in there. I like to save important ones like challenge packs or coach sign up in like a file in your Evernote or or a note somewhere that you can just easily access them. But anyway, once you insert the link, even if you're just, you know, going to your regular website, this is my regular website, beachbodycoach.com slash e 2 sonar is my website. And then, yeah, it'll make you put HTTP in the front. Just say yes and then you say insert. So if they were to click on this click here, it would take them to my main site directly, which I think is really huge. 
when I started using click here versus go to this website, then click this and click that, nobody clicked it. But when you just have these simple click here in an email, it's so much easier for people to say, okay, I'll click there. And it got a lot of response. So I did the um, a few links there for people to try and then one thing that really made a difference in my response is adding your picture to your email. So pick a picture, maybe the headshot from your Facebook like page. This is what I, that's what mine is. And I, any picture of you, maybe it could be a before and after. It doesn't matter. Having it personal and showing it being you what made a huge difference when people started responding to my stuff. Let me show you another one. that I made. Okay, here's my new coach welcome email. So I send this out to new coaches when they sign up under me. Again, you can say for your first name and you can put any of these bookmarks in that takes you to your direct link. And then I have them, that one of the first things I have new coaches do is fill out a new coach about me form. When they click this, I did the same thing I showed you before. Type the text, then highlight it, then go to the insert link and type your link. In this case, I used a WooFoo form, my, my WooFoo form for new coaches to find out what their goals are and, and what they, you know, why they're doing this. So that's great because it's the first thing they see. Click this form, fill it out. And then just, you know, some interesting thoughts, interesting points about new code new coaches and what you can do as a new coach and just really simply getting started and I can share this on the team page as well that's another one I did so anything you can insert your woofu forms any link you want to send and pictures so links and pictures really made a difference for me in um, getting people to respond to these kind of things so those are one touch emails I'll show you how to use them Go to your contacts, and I made a fake contact for Eric. That I, that it's Eric's name, and it has my email, so I can test my emails. I always test one sent to myself first, so I can see um, what what I'm what I'm sending first before I send it to anyone else, and make sure all the links work too. So you go to that. You can, whoever you're trying to send it to, make it a video, and then click send email, and then submit. It'll pull up a spot for you, and like I said before, you can do more than one person at a time. You can send 300 at a time to the same of the same email. Pick what you want. Say it's the Shakeology sample email that I just made and it'll pull it all up for you. You can customize it if you want specifically to them and then click send email and it will show up as being sent and you can test it and then send it out to your people. Simple as that. The other way I use automatic CEO is, oh, so back to one touch emails. I use those for sales. When we have, um, a sale or something to share with our customers. Um, even if you want to advertise a new challenge group, that is a huge deal. So, what, let me see. I think this is the one I made for when Insanity Max 30 came out. So I said, hi, whoever you are, put a picture in, and I use this, you know what? Yeah. This is, I use mostly what Automatic CEO put in there and just kind of um, made it my own. So you can create a one-touch email based off of one that already is or edit one that's already there or completely create a new one. It's entirely up to you. And then I said, do you want to be considered for my first ever Insanity Max 30 test group? Apply here. And that takes them to my WooFoo form. Got getting lots of response through WooFoo when you do it this way. And let me see. Another, okay, here we go. Here's one I made for our healthy holidays challenge. 
put the picture from, and this is just the picture from our Facebook event. And I just uploaded it to an email, made a little email, said, here's the results I've gotten. And that's huge. Send it to, I sent it to all 300 and some of my customers and said, do you want to join my holiday challenge? Click here. And that got a lot of response too. So anytime you want to communicate with your customers that are not on Facebook, this is the way to do it. What? Okay, so the other way I use automatic CEO is through the autoresponders. This takes a little bit more to learn um, and maybe and a lot to set up. But once you have them set up, they're gold mine for keeping in touch with people who you don't talk to on Facebook or you don't even know who they are. I don't know about you, but before this, anytime I would get an, a customer from Beachbody, I would take the time to go in and send them an email and never hear back from them. It was, I felt like it was a total waste of my time. Maybe once in a while I would get a response, but it, it was just precious time that I didn't have. So this is great for that. So again, I don't like the ones that they that they provide for you, but they're a great starting spot. I'll be with you in a minute. So I made my own. What you can do is so for example, the most cus the most time when you get a customer is an emerald coach or above, you'll get a new free customer. They just signed up as a free account. They haven't bought anything yet necessarily, but they have an account and now you're their coach. So it's your job to talk to them and find out what's going on. So I created this autoresponder and how you do that is you do create new autoresponder and you can copy it from one that's already there. So I just picked the one that was new customer and then made all the ones that say Aaron next to them because I didn't think they were quite me and I didn't get any response until I changed them to be me. So I, so pick one that you want to use it like. So you could do free play, free player membership customers and change the emails a little bit to um, be more like you, be more personal. So this is the one that I edited. And anyone that wants to see what they are, I can send you a test, what's called a test, and they send you all of the emails in the series um, right away so you can see them all. So if you want to see what I've done exactly, I'm more than welcome to share that with you and you can use it however you want. So how this works is that, see how it says day one, day 14, day 21, 28? Those are the days that these autoresponders will be sent out. Immediately when you enroll them into an autoresponder, the first day they'll get this first email. I'll be with you in just a minute. And then 14 days later, they'll get the second email and so on. So here's the first email that I made. And I just said, hi, I'm your coach. And my goal is to help you reach your goals. And then I just have a WooFoo form set up to find out about their goals, which is this a little bit different from my co coaching form because this is just about health and fitness and not coaching, right? So this is just my basic woofoo form. Yep, there it is. So this is just what they fill out when they're a new customer of mine. And when I put this in here, when I put this link in here, I had so much more responses. Pretty much everyone I send to this to responds, which is huge compared to the 99% of people that never responded for the three years prior I started doing this. Let's see if I can go back. Okay. So again, let's go back to the free customer. This is the first email they get. Have them fill out about their goals and put your picture in there. I can't stress how important that is. So I only really edited the first two because after that, if I'm not talking to them through Facebook or talking to them personally, then you know I'm just I just kind of like whatever 
whatever, the, if the emails reach them, great. If not, it's okay. So here's the second email for the free customer autoresponder. This one talks about Shakeology, right? They haven't bought anything yet. They don't have Shakeology. So this second email, if you haven't heard back from them, we'll talk to them about Shakeology. And then it just gives them a click here if they want to order, or they can respond to you. But either way, it puts Shakeology in their face, and you didn't have to do anything. It automatically sent this email to them 14 days after you originally signed them up for this autoresponder system. And then I think the third one is talking about coaching. Yeah. So now they're, now they're getting a little bit of information about coaching. And again, you didn't do anything. It automatically sends it to them 21 days after the first email. So those are great. Usually once someone responds with their WUFU form and I'm talking to them, if we're talking back and forth, I guide them to Facebook and take them off of this autoresponder if we've already talked about the things like for, for example if we've talked and now they've bought a challenge pack and they have Shakeology sending them an email about Shakeology doesn't really make sense and they might think you know you're just being salesy or using them so make sure you remember to take people off of the autoresponders if you get past this point or they become a coach or whatever move them to your coaches folder or whatever so another one I made is when you get a free customer from being Emerald that are club members. So you have to change it a little bit because it's not just a free free membership that they have now. They have, now they have a club membership, but it really just says the exact same thing as before. I just want to hear about your goals and I'll help you get started. So that one sends out on the first day, and then. This one asks them if they've looked around about their, their club membership yet and gives them um, some talk about Shakeology again and reminds them that because they're a club member, they get 10% off. So just kind of put that in their face too. Again, without you having to do anything. So those are the two emails that I use for people that are given to me, the, my free customers that are given to me for being an Emerald or Above coach. When you have Success Club customers, most likely they are a Shakeology one-time order or a Shakeology HD order. So for Shakeology one-time orders, I again made my own based off of what they used but kind of twisted it to make my own. The first one is just thanking them for their order. And again, I just want to know your goals. How can I help you? Made it super simple so they're not feeling like I'm selling them anything. And the second one is how do you like your Shakeology? And reminding them that they don't have to pay full price. They can upgrade to a coach account. This one I made my own wording because the one that they, they provided was a little too salesy for me. But still showing them that there's no reason to pay full price ever on Shakeology. They can upgrade to a coach account and get the 25% discount, which is mathematically worth it if you're on Shakes, regardless, no matter how you slice it. So it just kind of keeps, keeps emailing them at seven days, 10 days, 14 days, different things about Shakeology and coaching to see if anything interests them. And that was for one-time orders. So this one will focus more on, you know, getting them to order Shakeology again because they're not on HD. So for the HD orders, it's a little bit different. So these, again, these are Success Club customers that were given to me that are on HD. Or that they were a customer of mine that I don't exactly know and don't talk to really. And I put their email in and send these emails to them. First one again, just want to know your goals. What are your goals? How can I help you? Click here with the picture. The second one is again showing them to get it as a coach. 
it just kind of takes out the part about ordering again because they already are ordering it again because they're on HD versus the other email list where everyone was only getting it one time. And I just made a few other newer ones recently. So you can make whatever you want, any email responder you want. You can, um, you can do coach training emails I send out once a day. You can do um, and out anything. There's a ton of opportunity here. I'm just showing you the few ways that I think are the most beneficial. So if someone orders a fitness program from me, say they're an old customer, an old free customer that suddenly decides they want to order something and I have no idea who they are, we don't talk, so they get these emails. So hopefully try to get them to start talking and figuring out what their goals are. So First one just thanks them for their order and let me help you find your goals. I also let them know that we have challenge groups online and ask them if they want to um, join those for extra support and accountability. The one at seven days asked them to sign up for the Beachbody Challenge so they can get their free shirt once they complete their program and then get talks about Shakeology, right? Because this is just a person who has bought a program, not Shakeology. So it explains to them how to get Shakeology and also if they want to get it as a coach for a discount. And if you want to order today, click here. And they can always respond to any of these emails with any questions they have. And a, a CEO will send you an email notifying you that you have an email through them. And then I just did one specifically for three-day refresh people because it, it sends it out for them um, and ask them as, as how it's going because it's just three days, right? The first one is still, again, just thanking them and asking about their goals. How to stay on track after the three-day refresh, talking about Shakeology and coaching. They all kind of lead to the same place, right? but customize them to be your own. And I just put my name next to it because when you sign up a person to a new campaign, it doesn't necessarily show you which ones are yours and which ones are not. So I'll show you again how to do that. Go to your contacts. I'll go to my dummy account that sends it to me. Highlight it and say enroll into so enrolling is the term used for autoresponding. And you can pick any of the autoresponders to start enrolling them to. It sends the first one out immediately. So here at the bottom are all of mine that have Aaron next to it. So say this person is a new customer who ordered Shakeology one time from me. So you say enroll into Shakeology one time orders. When you click submit, it sends them the first email. And then whatever it's set up to do, seven days later or whatever, it sends them the second email and so on. And you can see when you go in and click on the person's contact, if they've opened it, if they've cl clicked any of the links, and it's a really great way to keep track of it all. So that's pretty much everything. That's how I use the autoresponders. That's how I use the one-touch email. So I use, in a nutshell, I use automatic CEO to communicate with my coaches, to communicate with my customers when they there's a sale or we're getting ready to start a challenge group or maybe I want to share a health and fitness tip with all of them. Um, anything of use, anything I want to talk to my customers, all of my customers at once that I wouldn't be talking to on Facebook necessarily. And the third way is using those autoresponders for new customers that are given to you either through the lead program for being Emerald or above, or Achieving Success Club. There are a lot more to a CEO that I haven't even gotten into. For example, you can do landing pages. So basically, Automatic CEO gives you landing pages, um, websites, specific websites for you that you can actually send to, um, you can post a link. I did this once and you can get people to fill out information about joining your team and I haven't even delved into this. It's a whole other world. When there's a new program coming out, you can use it to collect emails for people that are interested. 
watch the webinars to learn how to do this because I'm not even there yet. But even still, not knowing all of that, using it for the ways I described is worth the $25 a month in my opinion. The one time that I um, set out an email special about Max30 is new and here's the link to order the challenge pack. I think I sold four challenge packs to people that I wouldn't even have been talking to on Facebook. So that totally paid for itself from just one email. So if you have any questions, please just let me know. If you want to see all of my emails and what exactly I've said, I can set that up too. And I hope this training was helpful. See you guys later.